family of the internet this is Brad's back with another video and so half a year ago I unboxed the phone on my channel so that was the Oppo A54 today I am going to unbox an other phone which is the Vivo Y21e so here is the box so basically I was not going to buy any phone soon and this is not for me even so this is basically for my mom my mom had a Nokia 2.3 which was you know she was using it for the past three years she actually bought it before covid i think in 2019 in the middle of 2019 and just uh, uh, i think uh, half a month ago that phone uh, suddenly stopped working she tried to charge it uh, she tried i don't know whatever she tried to do it but that phone just wouldn't turn on so she also said that i had been using that phone for three years so it's finally time to upgrade and this time i helped her buy the phone and this is the vivo y21e so i could have made her buy a better phone but she actually had a budget already planned for her so that's why this was the best we could find in the budget the color is uh, uh one second the color is midnight blue now i don't know why this white white bluish color is given on the box but the actual color is midnight blue so let's just talk what about what all is written on the box so first we see the branding of vivo then we get to see written in big letters big alphabets y21e yeah y21e and then we get to see a photo of the phone then on the side we get to see again y21e and vivo ipl written uh, vivo is the title sponsor of ipl and then here we get to see some features so here first is the snapdragon 680 processor then there comes it with uh, a 5000 mAh battery by the way this phone supports fast charging so that's another good feature and then it com also comes with an 18 volt fast charge as i just told you so a phone which is of 12000 now i guess it's 12000 and it comes with an 18 watt fast charge and it also comes with a snapdragon 680 processor i mean what else you can ask in a 12000 phone i mean a fast charge and a qualcomm processor so it just um, it's just amazing so now let's unbox the phone first of all the seal is not there because we have to check the color so yeah that's why because sometimes people think that this is a used product it's actually not the seal is just not there because i had to check it so now let's just unbox and by the way one more thing before the unboxing that i bought this from the offline store but if you want to buy it online then the buy link for you will be given down in the description below but if you also want to buy it offline then i will give you the address of the store in my description down below so you can check both of them out and you can actually look which one of them is better for you but i will never prefer you to buy such an expensive thing online i will definitely prefer you to buy them offline so but at the end the choice is yours so but for me i have to do unboxing so let's just unbox it one second so unlike the a54 we don't get the earphones in it but that's a completely different thing that was i guess a 16,000 phone and this is a 12,000 phone uh sorry if i if i mentioned the price incorrect i don't actually remember and the last uh, last time i checked price was the time when i unboxed this phone on the channel so now let's just quickly unbox it and here you can see there is a seal again so let me just uh, quickly cut it i forgot to bring my unboxing tool today so i will have to use my nails to cut the seal so i will cut the seal and meet you right back Yo, so here the seal is off and for the first time i have to use uh, my nails because the first time i didn't bring my unboxing tool my cutter with me anyways finally the unboxing finally after three takes so here is the box which is off and now first as soon as you open the box we get to see an accessory box which it has big big written vivo so let's just quickly open it first here is the bill and some more paperwork which i don't care about then here is the cover the most important thing is that this is a 12,000 phone and it still comes with a cover and here is a some more paperwork so this is basically an important information card and a warranty card as well there is a um there is a a quick start guide well usually i we people don't read it but let me just go through it i will just see so here all the smartphone accessories are written so here in the phone we get a cell phone a charger a usb cable a type c cable a phone case eject tool warranty card and a quick start, start guide which i am just reading so i will claim the warranty after you know making the unboxing video so here is the cover it's a silicone cover just like we got for the a54 so i don't think there is anything else inside the box yeah 
so well this is the cover whenever a silicone cover comes with a phone it looks so good and now uh, when i bought my a54 the cover used to look as shiny and as good as this but after uh, one year of using it let me show you the situation of the cover see it was as white as this but now look at the you know just the situation it is in dust is all over i don't know what all is on it i don't even know i just want to buy a new cover my mom doesn't let me buy one she says that first use this cover for one whole goddamn year and then she will buy me another one so i'm just like rubbing it some way so now come let's unbox the main event not now not now not now like any other unboxer we are not going to unbox it right now let's keep the phone aside first let us see more some more things so i don't know what is this for we got this with the phone only then this is a i don't know whatever thing it is so uh, here we get to see the power adapter so this is an uh, uh, 50 to 60 uh, gigahertz uh, power adapter so here you can see here the branding is not given at the back the branding is given vivo but on the top on the side on any other place the branding is not given so this also looks shiny white and then coming on to the type c cable so this is the type c cable and here it is out as you can see the cable is good i mean it's long so my mom's previous phone it had micro usb with no fast charging but this phone will now for the fi finally it will have fast charging my mom used to use feature phone just six years ago she she upgraded to using smartphones and this is her most advanced smartphone yet so here is the wire it is, it is a type c white wire so and here we also get to see the ejector tool the same ejector tool and yeah well nothing else in the box so now let's just put the accessories for a side uh, aside for a bit and now let us focus on the main event which is our phone so here it is finally I hope I didn't damage it in excitement, whatever. Lol. So here, as you can see, let's talk about the physical dimensions of the phone. So here we get to see two cameras. Actually, some people get confused, like why are there, why are not there three cameras? Because at the, from you know far, from far away, you may think that there are three cameras. But when you look closely at one camera, AI is written. As you can see, I don't know you. I don't think you can see. But on one camera, AI is written. We get to see a drop. I don't know what this type of camera is called but a uh, type of selfie front camera so well this phone just like the A54 first of all I will now stop comparing this phone with the A54 so will this also have portrait mode uh, at the, uh, which is supported in the front camera as well as the back camera so well now here we get to see a small branding of Vivo and here we're talking about more physical properties or whatever you like to say that we get to see a fingerprint scanner not like the back old one or in the in-screen fingerprint scanner we get to see a side lock we also see a support of face lock and we also see a support of pin code so well this phone is also supporting all the three measures of privacy here we get to see the volume rockers volume up button volume down button here we get to see nothing absolutely clean matte finish sorry 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 here is the sim card slot so the sim basically it has two sim card slots for the nano sim and one sd card slot so i didn't buy the sd card because my mom said that when the phone's storage starts to get almost finished i mean this is a 34 gb 32 gb phone so like the when the storage is 29 gb 30 gb then she will upgrade to an sd card and excuse me actually i'm having a little bit of you know cuff and cold so here it's absolutely clean a black matte finish actually the color is midnight blue first i was liking the color given on the box but then when i saw this color i absolutely fell in love with this and my mom also liked it very much see man literally it is made of metal and look at the matte finish and then here on the camera it is written as spherical i don't really know what it means but now let's talk about more physical dimensions here we get to see a 3.5 mm phone jack we get to see a microphone we get to see an 18 watt fast charging type c cable port and we also get to see our speakers uh, and so now i guess it's finally time to uh, boot it up so we have as you all know that we have to press the power button so yeah here it is powered by android 
so now let's see the with cover look while it boots up so here it is without cover as you have seen it looks so clean man and then here it is with cover here it is with cover i mean yeah it's look it looks so good i mean it's so comfortable and so good to you know keep this in hand so here is the phone uh, so this is the phone and we get to see a lot of features like auto rotate it from a flashlight and wi-fi all of the normal features that we see in a normal phone so here are some more things that they like smart monitoring and then ultra game mode which i have not seen in many of the phones and so here we also get a cal option for calculator so well i have not seen this i have never seen in any phone that when you open the this when you slide it down then we get to see an option of calculator opening the calculator directly so well and uh, this also has a feature that when you will close it another wallpaper will automatically come up so here now as you can see the display it, it looks quite good so this phone supports the fun touch os 12 version and the device name is the vivo y21e and then the processor that we get to see is the 2.4 gigahertz snapdragon 680 octa core and i'm all seeing this from the about phone option in the settings now the screen is flashing a little bit so you can't see um still you can't see so i'm just telling you all the features from the about phone the ram is 300 gb uh, and the android version is 11 and the phone storage is 64, 64 gb okay so this was the about phone i mean the software and all that and now um let's talk more about the displays and i have the color midnight blue but this phone also comes in another color which is known as the i don't know some diamond glow color so here as like many phones this phone also supports some very basic apps just like the video app the youtube app i don't know notes and recorder settings all of those apps and well i guess this is all we need to talk about this phone if i don't find anything more interesting about this and i'm so such a stupid person i'm reviewing about a phone and i forgot one of the most important things of a, of a phone which is the camera so sorry about my silly mistake but we can see the camera in the favorites app so here's the camera oh, yes oh. um okay i just have to agree to the private so here is the camera i think you can see you I mean, can't so here it is and now uh, let's talk about all the options that we get in the camera so first of all we get a photo mode and i will try to give some samples of the photos if i can so now let's talk about more features that we get in the camera so first when we go in the more section we get to see the option of panorama of time lapse of pro documents and live photo in video we get to see the normal video front and back camera both and in photo we also get to see the photo and uh, in front camera and back camera both mode and we also get to see the filters and we then we get to see a portrait mode and as i said you it suppose both front camera and back camera so well these are the options that we get to see in the oppo sorry vivo y21e so well yeah this is all that i this was all that i was actually in my camera the maximum file size was recorded so i was just saying that if you like this video give it a like and if you are new to the channel please subscribe thank you so much for watching bye